Francis Bacon. Francis Bacon believed that progress didn't come from guessing. It came from testing. Living in the late 1500s and early 1600s, Bacon watched as Europe began shifting away from medieval traditions and toward new ways of thinking about the natural world. But he noticed something was missing. A clear method for discovering reliable knowledge. So he set out to build one. Bacon's key idea was what we now call the scientific method. Instead of relying on abstract reasoning or ancient texts, he argued that knowledge should come from systematic observation and experiment. His process started with careful collection of data, real-world facts gathered through experience. From there, general principles could be formed by looking for patterns, not assumed through guesswork or tradition. He called this approach inductive reasoning. Unlike deduction, which starts with a big idea and tries to apply it downward, induction builds understanding from the ground up, beginning with specific examples and working toward broader conclusions. This meant science wasn't just about thinking harder, but about watching more closely. Bacon also warned against common mental errors he called idols, built-in biases that cloud judgment. These included things like favouring familiar ideas, trusting authorities too quickly, or stretching the facts to fit personal beliefs. His goal was to clear away these obstacles so that knowledge could be based on reality, not assumption. While Bacon wasn't a scientist in the modern sense, his vision helped define the mindset that drives science today. He treated discovery as a disciplined process one anyone could follow if they asked the right questions and gathered real evidence. By turning knowledge into a method, Francis Bacon helped move philosophy out of the library and into the lab, reshaping how we explore, test and understand the world.